7 shows Sonic's dead father winking at him through a picture on the wall, which proves the existence of an afterlife in the Sonic universe. Number 15 shows that Sonic is able to hibernate below delta waves, and those are the slowest possible brain waves, about 0.5 hertz. To go below them, Sonic would have probably died, and yet he is resurrected and lives again. And number 24, Sonic is shown to run at the speed of light, and if the rules of relativity are to be believed, that means his mass would have to infinitely expand, and he would need infinite energy to do this, and that would destroy the world, and yet he is able to do that without harming himself or those around him. Number 30 is actually within the Bible itself. It, it, it states, but like most peaceful times in the 21st century, it didn't last long. This Bible was written in 1991, nine years before the 21st century, and yet it prophesied our challenging political landscape. These four pieces of information are not purely canonical information, they are divine miracles, so of course I could not put them into a game. They could only fit in a religion. So I went on a wiki how, the foremost explainer of how to do things, and I knew somewhere hidden in their beautiful imagery would be the way that I could spread the word of Sonic to the masses. And before you get upset with me saying, Brian, aren't you just starting a cult? Look at this question answered by cute girl core. Technically speaking, religions and cults are the same. So I have formed my religion around Sonic the Hedgehog, and guess what? I have a confession. I've never played a Sonic game. Never in my life! I only tell you this now because you've already made it this far into the video, and the sunk cost fallacy states that if you feel like you've invested something, you're gonna see it through to the end. But it's okay that I haven't played a Sonic game because that means I haven't been tainted. I have never beheld the false Sonic. Only someone blind to the modern blasphemies of the Sonic franchise could see as clearly as I. Because if a hedgehog could commune with the dead, be resurrected, run with infinite energy, and have his gospel prophesy the future, then either 